Hi everybody. Juan Luis Londoño Arias, known professionally as Maluma, is a Colombian singer, songwriter and actor. Why Maluma? His real name is Juan Luis Londoño Arias, but he decided that Maluma would be his stage name, but where did that name come from? As he is a family-loving boy, he decided to honor it by creating his artistic name with the initials of his mother, father and sister's names, Merle, Luis, and Manuela. Born and raised in Medellin, he developed an interest in music at a young age, and began recording songs at age 16. He released his debut album, Mahia, a year later in 2012. However, his breakthrough album was 2015's Pretty Boy, Dirty Boy, which led to successful collaborations with several artists. He released FAME in 2018, to further commercial success. He followed it up with 1111 in 2019, and Poppy Wancho, released without further announcement in 2020. His single Hawaii reached number 3 on the Billboard Global 200, and became the first number 1 single on the Billboard Global excluding US chart. With sales of over 18 million records, albums and singles, Maluma is one of the best-selling Latin music artists. Musically, Maluma's songs have been described as reggaeton, Latin trap, and pop. 18 years before he sold out stadiums across the globe, Maluma was selling ham and cheese sandwiches. That's where my entrepreneurial spirit comes from, he says, a proud gaze peeking out from behind his black-rimmed, orange-tinted shades. As a 10-year-old in Medellin, Colombia, Maluma, born Juan Luis Londoño Arias, would neatly pack his homemade sandwiches and chote them to Aunt Anir's elementary school, where he would sell them alongside lollipops. Then he would put the money he made back into his sandwich startup. The idea of launching a record label had been on Maluma's mind for years. I wasn't at the right time to develop it because I was very young, the 28-year-old says, quickly adding, I know I'm still very young, but now is the moment that I feel mature, stable. Without a doubt, one of the artists of the moment is Maluma. Only 22 years old, this beautiful reggae tone has managed to win the hearts of thousands of women after she released her Bachelorette Barrow Gazette. He has also collaborated with several artists several times, one of the most recent was Mexican singer Talia and with her success she has put all of Latin America to dance since that night. When Maluma was a little boy of four, he played as a singer. She picked up bottles of her mother's beauty products and sang songs by one of her favorite singers, Hector Lavoie, while she imagined they were microphones. Maluma is a devoted animal lover with one more point in his favor. Dogs are her favorites although she generally likes any breed. Maluma loves dogs and of course there's one. His name is Killit and he is already a famous dog with nothing more than 16,000 followers on Twitter. He was very romantic when he was younger as he devoted himself to selling love letters to his friends so they could conquer the girls he liked. He also wrote letters of forgiveness and reconciliation and sold to acquaintances when he had problems with his partners. Maluma became passionate about football unfortunately having to choose between football or music after recording their first song. He had practiced the sport for years but decided to quit and remembered it as a good experience so he devoted himself to what he wanted most, music. Don't get me wrong, it's not because he doesn't like to work, he likes to rest. One of the things that pisses him off the most is not having some time to get some sleep and take a break. It's exhausting for him when things don't go as planned because he's a born perfectionist. Maluma is a kid who loves originality. He shows what he is and says he will never undergo any cosmetic surgery. When he was a child, even those who did so much nonsense and crime wouldn't have worked the eagle's nose. One of the things that bothers you the most is disrespect in any field. It is somewhat intolerant that people are in conflict. Although he loves his fans, some get very upset when they want to go too far and are too brave. He doesn't like that they try to touch him or that they don't respect his space. Maluma wants his fans to understand that he is a person like him and deserves respect like everyone else. Although she is still young and does not plan to have children, Maluma loves babies. He likes to share his photos with them and shows his love to his nephews at every opportunity. This handsome Colombian is still single but never loses hope of finding the woman of his dreams one day and hopes that he is safe with a vivacious vision who is not jealous or derelict, 
compassionate and not jealous. Despite a busy schedule, she never forgets to visit her home and family in Medellin, Colombia when the time comes. But enjoy your free time in the company of your loved ones. Maluma likes to exercise a lot and although he is busy most of the time, he likes to exercise for at least an hour a day wherever he is. Exercise is essential for this singer. Maluma has a number of singles that have charted within the top 10 on Billboard Hot Latin songs, including Felices Los Four, Baro Cassette, and Corazon. His collaborative efforts Chantaje with Shakira and Medellin with Madonna have reached the top of the Hot Latin Songs and the Dance Club Songs chart, respectively. He has worked with other international artists, such as Ricky Martin, J Balvin, and The Weeknd. Maluma has won a Latin Grammy Award, an MTV Video Music Award, two Latin American Music Awards, and been nominated for a Grammy Award for Best Latin Pop Album.